Well, I wasn't expecting that. Okay. Oh, wow. That is definitely bigger. Oh my gosh. That is a lot bigger than I was anticipating. So I am on this lake here. On uh, Emerald Coast. No idea. I don't even have need zones on this lake yet. It's crazy. He's huge. Let's see what else is down here before we get committed. I know, I jumped you all up and spooked you. Sorry. That's pretty insane right there. Got another set down here. A nice looking rack on a level three. Back. That's a very tall boy. Where's our big boy? Right there. Almost gifting himself to us. Let's slow down. Wind is perfect for this. Oh my gosh. That's wild. Three, I guess, just twins. Anybody else? All right. Well, that is my first level five axis deer that I've ever seen in my life. What a weird rack. I don't know how I feel about that. God, I hope he doesn't troll. That would suck. I think they're high troll species. But I'm not sure. Seeing as he is my first real, true, honest to goodness diamond potential, I'm not going to take any risks. I've got my varminter here. It's going to do a nice clean shot. Just like that. That should be good. Ah, she's huge. Yep. Who's pumping at me? Little sandbar deer. Aww. Ooh, nice level four. They sound like little space aliens. Adorable. They're also dead. Okay, so here's our little sandbar. Oh, I, I completely missed his heart. He would have been a gold, but... um. 166 makes diamonds, so I just hit him in the wrong spot, but he is kind of cute. He's got a very angry face. But here's the thing. Um, I also spotted over here. There they are. That fella. So not diamond potential, but bigger. So on my way over there, I'm going to go ahead and take him out too. For the fun of it. That should have gone right through that shoulder into his lung. And yes, he's dropping. So that's good. Don't have a diamond sandbar yet. I have been trolled by them already. So they are on my list of animals to be angry at, I suppose. We will eventually pick up my <laughs> level 5 axis deer. He is down there. I need to go get him. And we will... Um, for sure check him out but i just happened to glance over and saw this guy and i was like he's a little bit bigger so i want to go check him out should be right over here so Ooh. little hog deer level three be nice to have a di double diamond day that would be fantastic not gonna lie been a while since I've had one that wasn't a fallow deer. Oh, the grind. Oh, the grind. All right. Hi, friend. Hmm? Yeah, I kind of figured you would be. Probably a wise decision. Oh, my God. Everybody calm down. Okay. All right. So let's pick this feller up. 
nice gold. So we, oh man, we were definitely a little far forward. We should have been further back, but we got them anyway. 135, not bad, not bad. Kind of on the smallish end. Still really pretty. I do love their little round ears. They're very cute. Very, very cute. Okay, coming up on that level five. Hopefully it doesn't troll, I'll be sad. I don't know enough about Axis Deer Racks to know if that's thick enough, or tall enough, or any of the enoughs. Let's get a few pictures anyway, just in case. For the Discord. Go to map and take this off. Uh, nice. He looks good. Looks really good. All right. I think I'm just going to go ahead and do this. Ah, my first time in Axis Deer. Oh my gosh. That's wild. 231. Oh, he's a big boy. I, I don't know if that's max weight or not, but, um, yeah, he's, he's sizable. Let's taxi him real quick so I don't lose him, but, um, oh, wow. 231 and the minimum score is 217. So yeah, he seems pretty big. Excellent shot at, um, 185 yards. Let's look at his true score. Oh, he's perfectly symmetrical too. That's, that's awesome. That's really, I, are they... They're in the true rec system, right? They they can have wonky stuff. I don't know. But yeah, that's that's pretty cool. So that was the hunt for a diamond axis deer that I went on a few nights ago over in Emerald Coast because I didn't have one yet and I really wanted one and it was great to see one finally. There is a big difference in the level five racks than say the level fours that I've seen. So I've seen some level fours that came close, didn't quite make it. But as a result of this hunt, I decided on my last live stream on Sunday that I would jump over to Park Fernando and look for another diamond axis deer. I was really hoping to find another one to pair him up in the lodge. Ultimately, the hunt turned out a lot different. Our focus changed and I ended up getting a diamond in a species that I thought I originally had a diamond in. Turned out I didn't. So please enjoy a few clips from my live stream going over some of the more interesting parts of the hunt, including probably the fuggliest rack I've ever seen in my life. Thanks, Grandma Kate. And it was one of my absolute favorite experiences. So please enjoy. Hi, friends. What? Oh my god, guys! Oh my god! What the heck? Please tell me that's not a troll. Alright, well, that's what we're doing. Uh, uh, surprise! No, I'm kidding. That's not your surprise. Whoa! <laughs> Alright, let's, uh, let's, uh, go get this, uh, oh, level 9 buffalo, beefalo thing. Oh, okay. Here is a herd that is drinking. Is my big boy in this herd? He may be by himself. There's a nice level seven. Oh, little cinnamons. I don't have anything to shoot you with, cinnamons. You know what? I don't think my big boy is down here. I don't think this is the right herd. Is there a lake down here? There is. Maybe he drinks here. Are you stuck? Do you need help? If I touch you, I'm die, but I would love to give you a little push. Uh. Hmm. Fail? It's also that. Which was a hard shot. Or no, it was double long. All right. Oh my gosh. <gasps> what the world? <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Hold the phone. What am I looking at? That is a wonky feller for sure. Oh my god. All right. Well, I'm keeping that. Oh, not safe harvest. I'm going to taxi you. 
That is wild. I've never seen a, a rack like that ever. That 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 was that was all sorts of kind of different. And I thought the eggshell white was going to be common for some reason. And so I taxied the male and did not taxi the female. That shattered me. There he is. There's my beef. There is my big beefy boy. He is nervous. That is okay, my friend. You're welcome to be nervous. I would be too if I had horns like that. All right. I am not going to do anything stupid. I'm not going to take him with any like crazy method. I'm not going to like go get a bow or nothing. We're going to do this with the 338. Gosh, look at the size of that rack, though. He seems to have stopped his milling about. And while I don't mind a quartering shot, I'd rather not take a quartering shot if I didn't have to. My goodness, look at the size of that rack. I hope he doesn't troll. Are you going to get the angular? Probably. The more and more I think about it, the more and more I want it. Guys, what's a diamond for water beef? 167? All right, what's the score? Yeah, he'll probably make it. Probably. All right, here we go, guys. That should have been good. Yep. All right, we'll see you in a minute. I've never got a pie of albino or pie bubble for just a melanistic. Well, melanistics are really hard to get, so congrats to that. Nice. Look at the size of this beast. It's a shame he fell in the bushes. All right. Uh-oh. Sorry, I thought I heard one running up on me. Shame that he fell in the bushes. All right, I'm not going to bother. It's not good photos. All right, here we go, guys. Diamond water buffalo. Please, please, please. Yes, it's a diamond at 173. Who voted 173? All right, let me go back. Um, 167 was j Room. Liam said 160. Oh, never mind. That's when we were going back over what's diamond. Oh, let me taxi him real quick. Cool. Um, so let's see. The diamond, blah, blah, blah. That's definitely a diamond. Kate said 182.3. Uh, well, uh, or 172.3 was Kate. Jody guessed 173 dead on. j was 171. So, Jody, <laughs> I think you're the closest, actually. Or is it... Yeah, yeah, you're the closest, I think. No, wait, yes? Yes. Yes, you are. I'm sorry, numbers, numbers, but yay! <laughs> we got him, and it was a good shot. It would have been a hard shot. Now I just got to know if I actually have a diamond in my lodge, because I can't remember if I taxied a mythical or a diamond. Or... Darn it. All right, I'll just pull it from the live stream. It's all right. <sighs> it's hard to remember to do all these things. All right. Let's see, where are you? Are you even here yet? You should be here. I have been saving this for you guys because, you know, I like yin stuff. Ah. Pull up on the hill. Ah, there it is. Right up there. Let me get my zoom gun on. You see what I'm seeing as it fades out? See that? Come on, fade out. Here. Let's look at you for a minute. Look! It's a piebald female axis deer. Yeah, that's who we're going for next. And she's in a pretty good spot. I'm gonna break out my varminter. Are y'all ready? Here we go. That should take care of her. All right, and we got vital blood, so no worries there. And again, I forgot to record. I'm gonna have to pull so much out of this live stream. Oh my gosh. That's fine. It's fine. Everything's fine, right? Everything's fine. Everything is awesome. Everything is cool when you're part of a team. Enjoy your content and live streams. Thank you so much at Modern Outdoors. I really appreciate that. 
All right, here she is. I've never even seen one before. I have been told that of the piebalds, this is probably one of the best renderings pre-update. So let's get some photos. Shame she didn't fall better, but you know, escapes. She is super pretty though. Probably one of my favorite piebalds. All right, let's go ahead and confirm her. Yeah, just a little piebald female. Aw, she looks so sweet. I do like the patterning on her too. Let's take a little closer look. Very nice. So had she not been piebald, she would have been a dark color because you see these dark patches, it would have extended down her back legs and she would have had this dark pattern up on her neck and over her ears. So that's really neat detail to see. She's so pretty. Let's taxi her. Ooh, spots and patches make a good combo. Yes, they sure do, Jody. All right, so that's awesome. All right, so yes, this was it. Now, I can't remember. Is this a mythical or is this a diamond? Oh, <gasps> I don't have a diamond water buffalo. I was thinking of this guy, the Cape Buffalo. So I remember this hunt and it's in a, it, it, it's actually featured in a video called Dances with Bulls. And, um, it was ballerina themed and uh, it was a really great hunt. And this has been the largest one that I've ever seen so far. So without further ado, we're gonna replace him with this guy. Oh yeah, there's a marked difference. Is he a little wonky? Looks a little wonky to me. Nice. I didn't realize that. That's awesome. And this other guy who I'd like to keep in this room. Oh man, I'm gonna have to look for him for a while. See, I've got all these diamond fallow deer I don't even know what to do with. Which is kind of sad. Oh, I've got another diamond moose I gotta pose too. Um, there we go. He's gonna go up there and just be in the space as well. That's awesome. That is my first diamond water buffalo, ladies and gentlemen, that we got to hunt. So I was mistaken. And yeah, wow. <laughs> so cool. All right, y'all. I will see you on my next adventure. Bye.